Hello guys, welcome to part three of this introduction video, helping shooters learn the game of craps better so that when you walk into a casino, you can play. Today we're gonna to cover the uh, come box, how to bet with the come box, the odds that it plays. Uh, some people call this uh, the three point molly. As, we've, as we have discussed before, the shooter will receive five dice and upon playing the pass line or don't pass line, you'll be able to shoot. I'm going to start today with $150. Uh, that was one of the suggestions in one of my videos that I start with $150, play for a little bit, and let you see kind of uh, how it goes. I want to say, however, though, that I could start with $150, and at the end of this video, I could be up to $300, or I could be down to $0. That's part of the game of craps. That's why it's called gambling. But um, I'm just going to start with $150 here that I'm going to take. Uh, when I'm playing today and I'll keep you updated with how much I've made in my bets so that you can kind of see how some of these things work. Okay, let's get started. I'm going to choose two dice here. The other three, of course, go to the side. And I'm going to show you how to play with the come box. Okay, I always play $5 minimum to start out with on the pass line. Now you're ready to go. Here we go. Here's the shot. An eight. The point is an eight okay we've talked about the odds bet already in a previous video and i always take my double odds one of the best bets in the casino is that bet right there with the pass line another good bet comes with the odds of the come box if you want to make a come bet the point of course is going to be on we just rolled an eight so you're going to see the on puck be on the number eight and people are going to start making bets all you do simply is drop your chip, your $5 in the come box and say uh, $5 come bet. And, and the dealer would say it's a bet or something to that regard. And what's going to happen is whatever number is rolled next, that $5 is going to be transferred to that number. However, the come box works just like the pass line. If the point is off and a 7 or 11 is rolled, you win even money. The same is true here. If a seven or 11 is found, you're gonna be paid even money. If a two, three, or 12 is rolled, then you're going to lose that $5. And so let's go ahead and roll and see where this $5 is going to end up. Here we go. And uh, it's gonna to go to a 10, okay? Hard 10, that's two hard numbers right there. I need to be uh, betting on hard ways, but I'm not. So the come bet, you're going to see the bet, depending on where you are at the table, uh, be at the back of the box. It may even be at the side of the box if you're on the side of the table, things like that. Place bets will be up here in the front, which you see I don't have any. Now, the dealer's probably going to ask you, do you want odds on your come bet? And you may wonder, well, how much can I put on there? It's the, Usually, it's the same number of odds you can do with the past line. And so... If you put your $10 out there, or you can put $5 if you wanted to, then you could say odds on my 10 or odds on my come bet, and they would set it up like so. If you do the don't come bet, then your chips will be in the back of that box. But we are doing the come bet, so it's gonna be right there. Okay, so what I would also do at this point, I have one come bet, is I would go ahead and I would do another come bet. If you're looking to do the three point molly, some people call it that, then simply another $5 here we go in the box. And now we're gonna roll again to see what we have. And it's an eight, okay? The eight has been hit. That's good news for us, okay? A lot of people wonder what's gonna happen to my come bet. Well, here's what's gonna happen first, okay? They're gonna put your come bet to the eight. The point has been hit. And so we've talked about payouts for the pass line. We're going to go ahead and do that with casino money at this point. Even money right here. And then six to five odds, I have $10. So I win $12. Okay. And now I can stack this. This money is mine to keep. And the point's going to go to off. And the dealer's going to say, uh, do you want your come bet? Uh, odds on your come bet. Of course you do. So you're going to put... Uh, lay your odds, you're going to drop your odds, and they're going to put your odds on your come bet. Okay, now with the point off, you could have your eight and your ten still working if you wanted to, 
while it's off. If an eight was rolled and I wanted my come bet working, and let's say it's rolled again, they would pay me for my front line, $5, but they would not pay me for my odds. I would get them back though. So it'd just be a $5 gain. And so I'm not gonna do that because I, I want those odds working. The odds is one of the best bets in the casino. Uh, you've cut down the casino edge to minimal. And so I want that to be not working. You don't have to tell them it's not working usually. Usually they know what's not working, they assume because that's the better bet of you being paid, okay? So the point is off. I still have my pass line bet and my two come bets which are not working. The dice are rolled and it's a seven. That's a good time to see a seven. Front line winner, $5. Now let me talk about this. When this situation happens, 99% of people pick up their $5 and put it back on their stack. But uh, this is house money. This is even money. And so what I like to do is I like to stack it. Okay, I'm gonna stack it now. I've got $10 on my pass line. Um, and it's like I never saw that money. So here we go, let's roll again. And the point is an eight. The point is an eight. So again, if I, if my come bet uh, would have been working, I'd have just got my $5 back. But here's what we're gonna do now, okay? I really wanna see an eight. I've got a $10 bet, I'm gonna do double odds, which is $20. And I've got a come bet out there. And so an eight would be nice. Okay, so we're looking for an eight or a 10. Now one point about the three point molly is that right now you only have two points. Okay, you have an eight and a 10. So some people would go ahead and bet uh, one more come bet. Um, and so I can do that just so we have three points. Some people would not, okay? We wanna see an eight. That would be very, very, very good to see, okay? And look in here, okay? We've got a five, we've got a three. So there's our eight and we just won some money. Okay, first off, the uh, come bets, of course, is going here. Let's pay this out first. Okay, a come bet pays even money for your bet. And then the point, um, that bet was an eight, so it pays six to five. And so it's just like a pass line bet. And so I won $12. They're going to stack it for you. They're going to give this to you. And they're also going to put your odds here or your, your come bet there. Ask you if you want odds. Of course you do. And they're going to pay you for your front line. And you may remember, I stacked that $5 gain when I rolled that seven. So now I get $10 for my front line. And because I bet $10 and I can have double odds, I've got $20 in my odds. It pays six to five. So they're going to uh, match that right there and make it that sixth dollar with it. Okay. And so I just won $24 on that bet. So I'm going to pick up this right here. At this time, I am ahead of where I started. And so I would leave my $10 pass line bet out there. Some, some people would, would take it. That's the gamble part of it. I can't tell you when to take your money and things like that. But the point is off. I'm going to leave my $10 on here. And uh, let's see what we get right here. Eight. A hard eight. Okay, boy, that, I'm hitting that eight a lot, and I'm hitting the hard ways a lot. My uh, my bet's not working. The point is, point is on. My come bet was not working. Again, I only have two points. I do want to take my odds. I'm gonna put my odds there. I don't have three points. I only have two points, and so if I want to have three points, I've got to go ahead and put five dollars in the come box. Let's see what we get, and it's a five. It's a five. And so uh, dealers are going to take my, my $5. They're going to move it to a five. They're going to ask me if I want my odds. Of course I do. So now I win with a five, eight, or a 10. And I've got my three points. Don't want to see a seven. I'm not going to put any more money on the table at this point. Let's get a roll here. And a 10 is hit. And guys, that's another hard way. I should have been betting on those hard ways. I've been making some money. Hard 10 is rolled, so my, my come bet has been hit. And here's what it's going to pay. Okay, my $5 bet is going to pay $5. And then the 4 and the 10, the odds on that are true odds. 
So you're going to get double whatever your odds bet is. I have a $10 odd bet because I bet $5, so I win 10. And so they would stack it up for you and they'd give it to you. And so at this point, I only have two numbers. I'm gonna put five more dollars out there uh, for a comeback so I can have my, my three points. I'm looking for an eight, an eight would be really good. And a five is hit, okay? A five is hit, that's my other come bet. And so here's what we're gonna do, okay? They're gonna pay me for this one. And some casinos, they'll set it up different ways, but I'm just gonna do it this way because it's easier to show you. I'm taking my odds on my new one, okay? And they would pay you first, but they're gonna pay you $5 for your original bet. And then, just like the pass line was hit, they're gonna pay you three to two odds. Okay, you had $10 out there, they're gonna pay you 15. They're gonna stack it for you, and that's your money, okay? Again, I only have two numbers. Now, I have two come bets and the point, but one of my come bets is the same as the point, so I only have two numbers, so I'm going with another come bet in the come box. Come box is treating me well so far, so here we go. And a six is rolled, okay? A six is rolled, come bets go into a six. They're gonna ask you, do you want odds? I drop them, of course I do. They stack them on there. And now we got my three points, okay? It's equated to uh, a lot of money on the table. I do have a lot of money on the table, but I've also uh, made money. One thing about a, a come bet is that you can't take it off, okay? Those bets are out there, and I've got 15, 30, 45 dollars out there, okay? But I've so far I've broke even, I'll show you after this hand. And I've got uh, $30 on the pass line. So I've got over $70 out there. So let's throw the dice and see. We're looking for a five, six, or eight here. Anything but a seven, really, we're okay. Here we go. A five, five is hit. And we're jumping up and down still because our come bet was just hit. And so let's take it off and pay it. Here we go. Five dollars original bet. Three to two right there. Here you go, here's your chips. They're gonna give them to you. I only have two points. I wanna make another come bet. And let's go. Ooh, that's, that's craps right there. We hit the number 12. I lose $5 right there. They take it from me because on a two, three, and 12, I lose. Just like a pass line bet, I lose that. And so 7-11, um, I win on a come bet. Yeah, two, three, and 12, I lose it. So I'm gonna put another $5 out there and see if we can get that back here we go a five going back to a five here we go they're asking me do you want odds yes sir and i've got the dice here we go five six or eight let's go eight eight is hit the eight is hit and uh i wish i was at a casino now because we're making money okay so here we go let's pay it out okay come bet's gonna come right here it pays even money on the front line and it pays six uh, to five, so it's gonna pay $12. And so I'm gonna rack this. And then the point is 12. And so um, I get paid on my pass line. Remember that, that small $5, I rolled that seven when the point was off earlier and I just stacked it. I won double money because I hit the last point. And if I didn't hit that one, seven, I'd have had $5 there and $10 there. But this is how the game of craps works. When you press something, when I put that $5 because that seven and I pressed it, I could have lost it, it's $5. But because I pressed it, it allows me to get double odds and now that has worked out and I've made probably over $50 off of it, okay? Front line is even money. Back line is, is uh, six to five. So there's four of them there. All you do is you match them Okay, trying to teach you how to deal a little bit too. And your ones, okay, because it's six to five. Okay, so you're going to stack it up, all kinds of wings. I'm leaving that $10 out there. I usually just bet five on the pass line, but I'm leaving that 10 out there um, because it's been very, very good to me. Okay, the point is off. $10 there. Combats are not working. Combats are not working if they ask you, say no, they're not, unless you want them to. And now the six, the six is gonna be on. And we've kind of had the same problem uh, since we started. 
a point is the same as a come bet uh, through this whole process. So if I'm playing the three point molly is what they what they call it, then I need uh, a come bet out there. Okay, so here we go. I've got my twenty dollar rods. I've got my come bet, and now we're going. Three craps. Three craps. Lost five dollars. New five is going uh, right there. And here we go. We're going to roll again. See what we get right here. Four. Four. Okay, so come bet is going to the four. Uh, not a bad number. I mean, it's it's one of the tougher ones to hit. But you just got to think, if it hits, you're going to get a good payout because it's the odds are going to pay double on it. Okay, so now I have my three points. Again, I can't take any of it down. Uh, but it's treating me very well. Here we're going to roll, and the eight is hit. I have nothing on the eight, so we're fine. Shooter gets the dice back, and we're just relaxing. And that's going to be a leaner, in okay, case so something else we have not covered in a game of craps. That roll would count. Okay, this roll right here would count, and I'm not saying it just because I have a point and a come bet. Uh, that's a leaner, but a clear number was visible and a six. And so the number would be a six at that point. And we got our come bet, even money, six to five, so it's twelve dollars. Stack it and rack it. I like that phrase. And then we've got, of course, six is the point. And so I've got to get more chips over here because uh, I've broken the casino. And so I get even money here again. I've got four laid out, so six to five is that right there, and I owe myself a dollar for that little six to five payout. So here we go. I'm gaining my money. I'm stacking it again. Stacking that five dollars has made has made me a lot of money. So our point is now off. We have two come bets plus we have our pass line bet. And we just rolled an eight. So the eight now is back on. We have our double odds. We have three points, which is good because playing that three point molly with our come, uh, our come roll. And we're gonna roll again. And the four is hit. Now the four is hit. Of course we have a come bet on the four. There's even money up, up front. Double money in the back. Again, I have to get more money because uh, we're making money. And so we're going to stack it up. Leave it there. Going to have $5 right there uh, because we're gonna, we want three points. So another comeback. Comeback has treated us well. Here we go. And five is hit. We just hit another comeback. <laughs> comeback goes there. I want double odds on it. They're going to, of course, would pay me first. Even money, three to two. There's my chips. Another five dollars uh, right there to get another point. And here we go. A five is rolled again. Five again. Guys, I, I wish I'd heard, I, we're at a casino right now. Three to five again on the back line. Because uh, we are winning all kinds of money. Of course, we want that's going to a five. That's going to be our double odds. And six is rolled. We don't have anything on the six. And look what I did. I forgot to place a come out bet. Okay, so I'm going to put that out there now. And a 10 is rolled. That's going to do a 10. Do you want double odds? Of course, I do. And we're going to roll again. And now you can see the dreaded seven out. Okay, but people are going to be clapping for me because uh, I just won some money for these folks. Okay, especially for me. For me. So this is uh, this is now a casino's money. Let's count how much we made. Okay, ten, twenty, thirty, forty. 50. Okay, there's 50. We're going to make our stacks here just like it. 
There's that. There's that. Still got some stacks. And guys, I always count my money twice. Uh, when they're counting it, I'll usually take one aside. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, that's right. They'll usually let you do that, okay? So, and we have stacks of 10, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So I'm getting this out here. So, we got 50, 100, 150, 200, 250, 300, 310, 325, 335, 345, 351 dollars. So we started with 150. We more than doubled our money using this uh, come box method or the three point molly. 300 and, uh, over 350 dollars right there. That is a very very good hand right there. It does not happen every time, but it did that time. I wish I was betting my hard ways. And I wish I were actually at a casino making that money. So there is a summary of the come box, how you play the come box with a three-point molly. More than doubled my money. If you have questions, please um, ask me in the comment section below. Share this video. Share this strategy with those that you know. Uh, that way they can start to learn this game. Um, any comments or questions, let me know. Look for a vi another video coming soon. Thank you for watching and have fun playing craps.